Claude, I have some questions for you so that people can know more who Claude Silver is. So let's start. What's your favorite color? <laughs> My favorite color, I love shades of greens and shades of blues. Nice. What's your favorite food? Oh, gosh. Lobster, sushi, chips and salsa, nice. carrots. <laughs> I, I have a range. <laughs> I'm a more savory, I would say. More savory than sweet tooth. Nice. Last book you read? Um, the last book I read was is Love Warrior by Glennon Doyle. And I what book it. would you recommend for HR people to read? Um, Setting the Table by Danny Meyer. I would, I would read. It's all about hospitality. Great. What would you say to your 18-year-old self? Wow. You need to let go of all of the things that you're telling yourself that are wrong. You just need to let that go and lean into what it is you're good at and become confident. If you're given the opportunity to change your careers, would you? Change my? Career. Oh, gosh. Well, I already have changed my career. <laughs> I mean, I'm now in the world of HR and I was in the world of, you know, strategy and, and advertising for so long. Um, but I do believe in pivoting, if that's the question. I believe that you should try many things, not just stick to a straight path. Do you have any regrets in your life? Um, you know, I have things that I'm, I'm sorry that I, I did it because they took time out of my life and they, they stunted some of my growth. Mm -hmm. um, I don't have any re regrets, though. What are you grateful for? I'm grateful for you. I'm grateful to, to have this opportunity to even speak to you and speak to your audience. I'm grateful for my daughter, my family. Uh, I'm grateful for the fact that I get to come to work and do what I love to do every single day. Great. What advice do you give for the next generation? Um, so the advice I would give for the next generation is to show up and be you. Mm -hmm. That is it please do not waste time trying to be someone else. And that is difficult today in the world of social media. Great. I would show up and be you. Great. And finally, what do you want your legacy to be? I would like my legacy to be that I had a generous heart and a generous spirit. And I believe that you have that heart and you are giving to the audience and millions of people who are following you or listening to you. And every time I hear you, I feel that I feel that love. And I'm also grateful that I'm in your presence and we're having this conversation together. And with that, my interview with you, Claude, comes to an end. Again, thank you for taking the time to ask you all these questions. And I believe it's very beneficial for the audience watching and listening in terms of job seekers, employers, company cultures, all the things that we have discussed. And for the audience, again, listening and watching, please like and share this video, subscribe to the channel, and tune in next time for a, another great uh, interview that I'm preparing for you. And Claude, again, thank you. Hope we can meet one day either in New York, in Vancouver, or somewhere in between this world. And keep in touch. Bye. Thank you.